Hello and welcome to another House of Wisdom Knife Review. And today we have a special treat. We have the Riot Mini Horizon D. And this is a very smooth knife. Riot is a company owned by David Dang in China, which makes high-end production knives. They also do OEM work for makers such as Todd Begg, Liang Ma, Faisal Yaman, Enrique Pena, Ramon Chavez. The list goes on and on. In the Horizon series, their first was the Horizon A, which had a 3.9 inch blade, and then it went through the alphabet B, C, D. The, the D had a 3.75 inch blade, and the Mini Horizon has a 3.44 inch blade. The specifications of the Riot are a blade length of 3.44 inches, a handle length of 4.5 inches, giving a total knife length of 7.88 inches. The weight of the knife is 5.29 ounces. We have some knives for comparison that are similar in length. We have first of all the Arc Form Slim Foot, next the Benchmade 940, and then there's also the Sleesh Buoy. All of these knives are approximately the same length as the Mini Horizon. The blade on my particular uh, knife is made of damasteel. Usually Riot uses M390 for the other knives. The blade is in a drop point configuration with a high saber grind and it has a top swedge which is notable also. The proximal aspect of the knife has some jimping which gives you good purchase. The method of deployment of the knife is by flipper. As you can see there is some jimping on the flipper and it is rounded so you can choose whatever angle you want and it flips out nicely with the flipper. The handle is mill titanium and there's some internal pocketing. I'll see if I can show that to you. There we go, the internal pocketing. There is also a lanyard hole at the end of the knife. The construction of the knife is with a half length back spacer. It has a gear pattern on it for much of the knife. The pivot runs on a caged multi-row bearing, uh, which is made of ceramic ball bearings. And it gives this action one of the smoothest actions you'll ever find in a high-end production knife. This action is just silk, and that's the reason that I purchased the knife. The action was just outstanding. The lock on the knife is by frame lock. And here you have it. You can see there's about a 25% lock up there. It also has a lock bar insert and over travel stop on the lock bar. The pocket clip of the knife is a 3D milled pocket clip with good retention. It has external hardware. The ergonomics of the knife are great. It's a large knife for me and it fills the hand and you have a little bit left over. There's a milled part out for your finger and the show side is milled a little lower so it's easy to get in to unlock the lock bar. The action of the knife as I've mentioned is world class. It is fall shut smooth. There is no problem with this action. It is great. The signage on the knife is minimal. The handle is sterile. On the show side, up here, you can't tell because of the damage steel pattern hardly, but it says Riot. And that is the only markings on the knife. The value of the knife is $335 for a base model. The fanciest one I found with carbon fiber inlays and damage steel was still under $500. But what are my opinions of the Riot Mini Horizon D? I really like it. Are there opportunities for improvement? Well, to start off on the clip, they could have hidden the hardware instead of leaving it external. I think that's a nice finished product whenever they do that. And it is a bit heavy. Even though they did have interior milling on it, it's still 5 ounces, 0.29. That's pretty heavy. What do I like about it? I love, best of all, the action of this knife, and that's what convinced me to buy it. It is silky smooth and drop shut due to the double row multi bearings that are caged. The blade is a damasteel blade on this version and I thought it was just simply beautiful. The fit and finish are excellent on Riot knives and this knife is no exception. It is well made. 
and it's a value getting a base model at 335 and the fancier ones for still under $500, you're getting a great deal. Some of my favorite knives this blade show were manufactured by Riot. The Enrique Peña Lanny's Clip, the Beg Mini Glimpse, the Riot Mini Horizon. Also, Ramon Chavez's new production line, which includes the Redención, the Sangre, and the Liberty, are also made by Riot. It's a great OEM maker. So if you like high-end production knives and would like to jump in with some of the custom knife features like damascus steel blades, carbon fiber inlays, multi-row bearing pivots, but you don't want to have to pay the custom prices, then the Riot Mini Horizon D might be the knife for you. You get a champagne quality knife on a beer budget. Well, that's the review for today. Like and subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you on the next House of Wisdom knife review video. Mm -hmm.